On August 23, 2023, India's Vikram lander made history, etching a new chapter in the story of space exploration. It touched down near the moon's enigmatic South Pole, a place no human or machine had ever reached before, a region shrouded in mystery and scientific promise. This was the thrilling climax of Chandrayaan-3, a mission that pushed the boundaries of what was thought possible, and showcased India's growing prowess in space technology. The lunar South Pole is a land of extremes with deep permanent shadows and ancient secrets believed to hide water ice untouched for billions of years, ice that could one day fuel future missions or even sustain life. By landing at Shiv Shakti Point, ISRO didn't just plant a flag, it opened a new frontier for science and humanity, inspiring a generation to dream bigger and reach farther. The world watched in awe and celebrated as India became the first nation to reach this challenging region, marking a leap not just for one country but for all of humanity. The lander's arrival wasn't just a technical feat, it was a doorway to new discoveries, a symbol of hope, and a promise of future human exploration on the moon and beyond. Bikram stood ready to deploy the Pragyan rover, both set to reveal the moon's hidden stories in just 14 short Earth days, a race against time under the harsh lunar sun. Their mission was ambitious, to analyze the lunar soil, measure surface and subsurface temperatures, and search for elements that could one day support life far from home, paving the way for future lunar bases and interplanetary travel. For the first time our eyes and instruments were focused on the moon's mysterious south pole, ready to change our understanding of the universe forever. The adventure at Shiv Shakti Point was just beginning, with every moment promising new insights and discoveries. The countdown to discovery had started, and the world waited with bated breath for what would come next. Unlocking the moon's secrets required the right tools, and Chandrayaan-3 brought them. Vikram wasn't just a lander, it was a science lab, equipped with CHASTE, a probe that measured temperatures beneath the lunar surface. Chaste's data would reveal how heat moves through the moon's soil, crucial for understanding where ice might survive. Meanwhile, the Pragyan rover, our mobile geologist, carried the Alpha Particle X-ray Spectrometer, or APXS. APXS bombarded rocks and soil with particles, reading the X-ray signatures to identify their chemical makeup. Together, these instruments gave us both depth and reach. Chaste provided a continuous thermal record, while Pragyan sampled the landscape. This approach lets scientists build a detailed picture of Shiv Shakti Point's geology and resource potential. Before this, we only had data from orbiters, now, we had ground truth. Vikram and Pragyan's findings would challenge old theories and spark new ideas about the moon's past and future. Their brief mission promised to reshape lunar science. When Pragyan began its careful analysis of the lunar soil at Shiv Shakti Point, scientists around the world waited with anticipation. The rover's advanced instruments were designed to probe the moon's surface like never before, searching for clues about its mysterious past. What Pragyan uncovered was a true chemical surprise, one that challenged long-held assumptions about the moon's composition. Unlike previous landing sites, the soil here was unexpectedly low in sodium and potassium, two elements that scientists had always expected to find in abundance, based on earlier missions and lunar meteorites. Instead, the soil was found to be unusually rich in sulfur, with concentrations higher than any other highland site ever studied on the moon. This was a startling discovery, hinting at a very different geological history for this region. This unique chemical mix suggested that the rocks at Shiv Shakti Point weren't just typical lunar crust, instead they appeared to be remnants of something much older and deeper, possibly material that originated from the moon's mantle itself. The landing site sits within the vast and ancient South Pole Aitken Basin, one of the largest and oldest impact basins in the solar system. This location likely exposed material that had been buried deep beneath the surface for billions of years. Pragyan samples offered scientists a rare and precious glimpse into the moon's early history, possibly dating back over 4 billion years to the time when the moon itself was still forming. These findings lend strong support to the theory of a lunar magma ocean, suggesting that the surface here preserves a unique mix of ancient crust and mantle, untouched by the volcanic activity that reshaped much of the moon. For the first time, we were able to study the moon's primitive building blocks, preserved in their original state, and untouched by later eruptions or impacts. This discovery is like opening a window into the very dawn of the moon, revealing secrets that have been erased or hidden elsewhere on its surface. With these new insights, Shiv Shakti Point has truly rewritten the story of lunar geology, forcing scientists to rethink what they know about our closest celestial neighbor. Thanks to Pragyan, the moon's deep and ancient past is finally within our reach promising even more discoveries in the years to come. One of Chandrayaan 3's most ambitious goals was to answer a question that has fascinated scientists for decades. Could water ice actually survive at the lunar south pole, one of the coldest and most mysterious places in our solar system? 
The presence of water would be a game-changer for lunar exploration and future missions. To investigate, Vikram's chaste probe was deployed, delivering the first-ever detailed temperature profile from this enigmatic region. This was a historic achievement, as no mission before had measured these conditions so precisely. The data revealed that the lunar surface could reach a scorching 82 degrees Celsius under the relentless sun, but astonishingly, just 10 centimeters below, the temperature plummeted, creating a dramatic thermal gradient. This showed that the lunar soil acts as a remarkably effective insulator, trapping cold and forming hidden pockets of chill just beneath the surface. These cold zones could be perfect for preserving water ice. Even small slopes that angled away from the sun were found to be much cooler than the flat ground nearby, thanks to the way shadows protect them from solar heating. This breakthrough data led scientists to a stunning realization. Ice could potentially exist just beneath the surface on any slope steeper than 14 degrees, not just in the deep, permanently shadowed craters as previously thought. Suddenly the possibility of accessible water ice became far more widespread than anyone had imagined, opening up new opportunities for exploration and resource utilization. This changes everything for future explorers. Water for drinking, breathable air, and even rocket fuel could be mined from these hidden reserves, supporting longer missions and even permanent settlements. The moon was no longer just a barren, lifeless rock. It was now seen as a resource-rich world, full of potential for human activity and scientific discovery. Thanks to Chandrayaan-3's findings, the dream of building a sustainable lunar base suddenly seemed within reach, inspiring new plans for human presence on the moon. The South Pole's hidden ice had become the key to humanity's future in space, unlocking possibilities that were once only science fiction. To understand Shiv Shakti Point's significance, scientists needed to know its age. By mapping craters and geology, they determined the surface is about 3.7 billion years old. This ancient landscape formed as life was just beginning on Earth, linking our histories. The moon preserves a record of the solar system's violent youth, erased on our ever-changing planet. Boulders and debris at the site tell stories of impacts spanning billions of years. Some rocks were hurled from distant craters, others from nearby impacts, creating a geological puzzle. The ground beneath Vikram is a mix of ancient mantle and younger debris, making it a scientific goldmine. Each rock is a clue to the forces that shape the moon. Studying this site helps us understand not just lunar history but the early days of our own world. Shiv Shakti Point is a time capsule waiting to be decoded. The lunar south pole is as dangerous as it is fascinating. Long shadows and deep craters make navigation treacherous, one wrong move, and a rover could be lost. The sun's low angle hides hazards, forcing Pragyan to move with extreme caution. Temperature swings are brutal scorching heat by day, deadly cold by night. Chandrayaan 3's hardware was built to survive just one lunar day, knowing the night would end its mission. Micrometeorites constantly bombard the surface, wearing down equipment and threatening solar panels. Boulders from ancient impacts add to the challenge, demanding nimble navigation. Every discovery was hard won, earned against incredible odds. The safe landing and successful exploration proved we can engineer machines for the harshest environments. Chandrayaan 3's triumph gives us confidence to plan even bolder missions. The South Pole's dangers are real, but so are its rewards. Chandrayaan-3's discoveries at Shiv Shakti Point are shaping the future of space exploration. The confirmation of accessible water ice transforms the moon into a potential refueling station and resource hub. The unusual chemistry, especially the abundance of sulfur, opens new possibilities for building materials and science. By studying ancient mantle rocks, we gain insight into the formation of rocky worlds, including our own. Chandrayaan 3's success in the South Polar region provides a roadmap for future missions, both robotic and human. The data on temperature, terrain, and soil composition is invaluable for designing the next generation of lunar explorers. India's achievement has made the moon a destination for all humanity, inspiring new dreams and ambitions. Chandrayaan 3 reminds us that curiosity driven exploration can unlock practical benefits and profound knowledge. The mission's legacy is a new dawn for lunar science, lighting the way for generations to come. At Shiv Shakti Point, the story of the moon and our place in the cosmos has only just begun.